You think mom did this? Yeah, this definitely is not one of the stages of grief. It's kind of creepy, actually. We've got to help mother realize that Felicia is gone. We've got to come up with a way to help Mother accept the fact that Felicia is not coming back. Hello, everyone. I'm glad you're here. Hi, honey, honey. Huh? Hi, Mom. Dad. Hi, sweetheart. Hi. Now, look. As I told your sister on the we phone... We know this is about Felicia. Yeah, we can see that. Do you know how disturbing it is to come in here and see all this? Uh, sweetheart, I know it seems inappropriate, but when I tell you why... Mom, we know why. You miss Felicia. And it's difficult to accept her death, but we've all had to do it. Kristen, she's not dead, she's here. In spirit? and Yes, Mom, and she will always be alive in our memories. Kristen, I'm, is... please, I'm, I'm trying to tell you something. Okay, just, just please wait here and, and just trust me, all right? Listen, I know, uh, I know you're all worried, but there's no reason to be. No reason to be? She's acting crazy. I know, it seems like she is, but, uh, the fact is, it worked. What worked, Dad? What are you talking about? Ridge. Kristen. Thorn, um... Just brace yourselves, all right, and try to understand. I know you're going to be angry and you're going to be hurt with me, but please, just at some point, I hope you'll, uh, hope you'll forgive me. Oh, my God. Felicia? See? I told you the new dude would be too much for them. Felicia. Come on. My hair is not that bad. I mean, yes, yeah, true. Mom shaved it. But I think I styled it pretty nice. You're alive. You knew. How is this possible? Dad, you told me she was dead. We saw you die. Honey, I thought she died in my arms. I, 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 I went with her in the ambulance because I just couldn't let go. I, I mean, miracle of miracles, the paramedics found a pulse, and I, I had them immediately take her down to the clinic where Dr. Ramirez was because I'd already been talking to them about a, a liver transplant. So you let us go on and on about her death at the party. You, you didn't say anything. Go Your on. mother felt it was best to keep Felicia's condition a secret for a while. Why? Why would you do that? I'm sorry, Kristen. I know you're angry, and I can understand it, but she had such a slim chance. I didn't want to put you through it all over again if she didn't make it. There was no guarantee the chemo and the liver transplant would result in a positive outcome. I didn't think you wanted to go through the uh, chemo anymore. Well, lucky for me, never, Mother never gave a damn about what I thought. <laughs> hey. Are you okay? I think I'm going to be around long enough to get on your nerves again. <laughs> Thank God. You didn't give up. Oh, please. She just wanted to have the last word. <laughs> Can't forget my handsome doctor back there. And yes, Mother brought me to his clinic. But he's the one who brought me back from the brink. You know, come to think of it, I could be pretty angry at you, Doc. You jipped me out of seeing heaven. Second thought, scratch that. Because I've got heaven. 
right here with you guys. <laughs>